The evidence is everywhere. More and more companies are going green, literally. Green marketing strategies are one of the main outlets that well-known companies use to promote their products, as well as appeal to the environmentally conscious consumer. Whether or not the green products are truly better for the environment than their normal equivalent, buying green products makes consumers feel good about themselves, often without regard to the company's degree of sustainable practice. Businesses focus their brand management toward a green image because demand for environmentally friendly products is surpassing the demand for general image products. This movement is also accompanied by businesses that falsely advertise products to appear more environmentally friendly, which is referred to as greenwashing. While many companies falsely portray themselves as using sustainable practices, we want to focus on one company that truly has internalized its own effect on the environment, Patagonia. Patagonia is a California-based clothing company focusing mainly on high-end outdoor clothing. Founded in 1972, the company has been environmentally conscious from the material used in its clothing, all the way to the company's own mission statement. Patagonia's own marketing strategy displays a focus on the environment, with the product being the secondary focus. Their selling point here is the product's use in the environment, not the product alone. But what really makes Patagonia a sustainable business? Let's look under the hood. Patagonia's sustainability runs true from its products to the company's own facilities. Recently, Patagonia completed the construction of a distribution center that is LEED Gold certified, providing the first LEED Gold building in Nevada. The main criteria it focused on was managing stormwater runoff, landscape and exterior design, water and energy efficiency, construction materials, greenhouse keeping, alternative transportation, and recycling. Since 1996, Patagonia used only organically grown cotton in its clothing line, and its most recent launch is synthetic fiber to fiber recycling, taking back its worn out clothing and reincarnating its own new products forever capturing the petroleum used in making virgin fiber. Patagonia also uses sustainable business practices. Despite the sky-high demand for Patagonia products, Yvonne Chouinard, the founder of Patagonia, wants to run his business so that it can sustain itself for the next 100 years rather than focusing only on maximizing his current profit. Patagonia remains a private company so that it can keep its true environmentalist identity established in 1972. Free from the pressures of a publicly traded company with shareholders in corporate politics, Chouinard and his wife can freely run the company with minimal environmental impact.